Hi friends, it is Quilty Mom here and today I actually have something I have no idea if anyone besides my friends is interested in seeing. <laughs> Why? I finally got my, I dropped it, summer cause box. Uh, yeah, I do mean summer. Yes, it is uh, end of August. Uh, this usually is here by like June. I think some people got in May. Maybe it was, you know, everyone got in June. Um, no, I did not uh, subscribe late. I just got mine like ridiculously, ridiculously later than everyone else. Uh, if you don't know about Cosbox, it is supposed to be an environmentally conscious uh, group, uh, not group, box that comes out four times a year seasonally it's like i'm trying to remember the exact price. it was like 54 dollars, i think with shipping um i think that it, it's obviously it's like 200 if you if you buy it for the year um i did last year this year i've been buying it seasonally because what happened is i loved one season then i didn't like another season um I was excited about this box. I do know it's in it because, you know, everybody has opened their freaking box already. But I'm I'm extremely upset by how incredibly long it took to get to me. Um, because I paid for it, like, literally a couple of months ago. Um, so I'm... I'm I'm very unhappy with Cosbox, and for that reason, I did cancel, and I, uh, I'm just not going to uh, resubscribe until, until at least the COVID thing is over, until, basically, I, I think a few boxes just don't have their crap together right now. Um, I, I've seen that with a few boxes, and I do get that shipping is an issue with you know, the post office and all that. But some boxes, they're not even shipping it. They're just, you know, whatever. And I don't think it's fair that, you know, so-and-so got their box like in June and then other people don't get it until August when they, you know, you've all paid at the same time. Um, I, I don't I don't respect that. It, it, it's, it would be different if I just subscribe now. But, yeah, um... But I'm going to show you the box. I, I am excited about what I got. So uh, there's that. Um, a little big heavy box. And hopefully everything is okay. It always comes with this magazine. Um, I'm going to hold on. I'm just going to try to find the items that I got. And... Uh, the uh, price of them. Ba ba ba. Okay. We are here. Okay. It always has this really cute sticker on there. Alright. It's got this bright and colorful postcard. That usually just gets trampled on. The first thing that I actually was most excited about. And. Oh, holy mackerel. These suckers are heavy. It is a set of three bowls. Uh, the value is $36. Um, like I said, I've seen these multiple times. This is the number one thing that I am most excited about. I love bowls. Um, probably because I break so many. <laughs> or I, I lose them. Or you get plastic ones and they melt. Uh, but. Yeah. Y'all gonna watch me like. Mess to get these suckers out of the actual box. Thank God for editing right.
Okay. Yay. Yay, I finally got my bowls. Hi, Molly. These are going to be really good chicken and rice bowls. So, these are as beautiful as I thought they would be. There are three bowls. They have this like blue and green design. They are white with like a, looks like a, it looks like a painting around the bowl. Um, and then they have like a blue green on the inside. So I like them very much. Like I said, the value is $36. Three sizes. They're just all slightly different. I like that they're they're all in good shape. This one's like a lighter green and a lighter blue on the inside. And this one is like a light olive green and a lighter green uh, on the outside. And then a green happy, on the happy. inside. It is about the size of my hand. Happy, happy. Yeah. Okay. I'm actually, I'm, I was, uh, I was super excited about the bowls and yay. Now this is something that I am extremely interested in also. Uh, it goes with the bowls or anything. They are silico stretch silicone lids. Uh, they are not expensive and I could have got them off Amazon. Um, they, but I, I love the idea of them. Uh, got it. Oh, you actually, what? You get six. Oh, that's a really good idea. Okay, so they are these stretch lids that um, basically cover bowls and I guess uh, other things. Uh, I mean, that it's, it's like different. I never use cling wrap anyway, so I guess it's like in place of cling wrap, which I never use. I, I used to, but you know, I never kept a good seal. All right, let's let's mess with one in a lid. Let's find the right one. Okay, let's. This looks like a good one for the lid. Whoa. Whoa. Oh, maybe that one wasn't. Let's try the next size up for the the bowl. Let's see. Cause you know, I, all I care about is keeping my chicken and rice good. Okay. Okay. This is actually cool. Um, so this is this is a lid on the bowl. Uh, hanging it upside down. That seems like it's got a good seal. All right, that's actually really cool, and I love considering. Um, one of the things I was most disappointed with Fab Fit Fun for the summer was, you, you know, they were acting like this is a typical summer and they sent us a bunch of stuff that was completely useless to us at the time. Um, so this is, this is real practical stuff. So yay. Okay. This next item is a reed diffuser. I got bergamot and grapefruit. The value is $35. Um, I heard that it is not that great. Um, so, obviously, the price is overhyped, where I think the other two items were probably pretty spot on. Let's give this sucker a sniff. I love reed diffusers. Um, all right, let's pop this sucker open. It is less than half full. Let's see if it's got any nice smell to it. Well, that smells lovely. Oh, I've never smelled white uh, bergamot and grapefruit together, but that's really nice. That's a really nice smell. Um, I, I'm hoping that's that's like a good, you know, good quality one. I heard it was like very mediocre, but I'm kind of hoping people are wrong about that one. All right, we've got a couple items left. So, 
d despite the fact that this is a good box, and I am definitely getting my money's worth, um, I, I'm gonna back. I'm still gonna back away from them for a while, just, just because. Uh, yeah. All right. The next thing is. But this. Okay. This is the PMD Clean in blush, navy, or teal. I. It's a ninety-nine dollar value. I got the navy. I have never used anything like this, so I'm not sure exactly how. Oh, it comes with battery. Okay. Uh, soft silicone bristles. I don't really know how you use this. Um, it's like got a facial massage and stuff. Hold on. I don't know. How the heck do you open the sucker? Woo. I, I, I'm smelling that diffuser and it's wicked nice, by the way. Hold on. Okay. So, this is lovely. Is that this? This is cool. Yeah, that'll be nice to wash my face with tonight. And yay! Okay. There's like still going off, and I'm like, hello. Okay, hello, my new friend. The next thing we have. Oh, put my glasses back on. Is the Restore Healing Balm? I'm kind of. I've been looking at actually if, if forward to this quite a bit. I have a cut on the back of my leg, and I heard that this was good for stuff like that. Um, this is, um, what the frig? This is a $30 value, and, um, yeah, chap lips, fresh tattoos, which, you know, that would be really cool to get a fresh tattoo really soon. I have a couple of tattoos picked out. Um, more tattoos, the better. So I'm going to put that on the back of my leg. And I can let you know later in the comments. If this actually like makes a difference. Oh, 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 oh I've, I've got stuff coming out. Uh, okay, well, it, it's like overly, overly excited. Like, oh, I'm happy to be here. Okay. Um. Uh, <laughs> it's late at night okay so the next thing is say high to hydration hydrolonic acid um i'm not gonna open this at the moment just because i have a bunch of stuff like this uh um ooh, i could have got bath salts bats bath salts would have been cool too uh i'm like all you know i'm totally fine with bath salts but the hydrolonic acid is a $25 uh, thing. Um, it's supposed to leave skin dewy and radiant. Dewy and radiant sounds good. And last but not least, oh, I didn't get those ugly ass earrings. Yay! I just realized... Because these don't feel like the earrings. So, yay. I'm actually super excited. I thought I was going to get those hideous earrings. Um, yeah. Woohoo. Yay for no ugly earrings. I, I, I'm I, sorry. I'm never a fan of the like hideous jewelry that comes in these boxes. I never use it. And these were some tassel -y things that I'm just like not a fan of. All right, so I've got a couple of roll-on oils. Yay. The first one is Secret Zest. It's a happy blend. Well, I need a happy blend because I am a grouchy-ass bitch lately. I mean, I'm, yeah, calming blend. Yeah, I need that too because, uh, so actually these are cool. I'm going to have to open these suckers up. Yeah, let's see if I can okay. be, like, calmer and less grouchy. Because, you know, it's not like it can hurt me any. Well, I mean, 
Okay. Let's see. Okay, so I managed to open these suckers up without killing myself, so yay. Let's try okay. the calming stuff. Which, it's, it's kind of late at night, and this is going to be really cool. I don't know where I'm supposed to put it, but, you know. It's, uh, it's got a lovely smell to that. Um, organic lavender rosemary. Ooh, okay. A little here, a little there. I'm off of this. Yeah. It's lovely. Um, yay. Okay, and here's some happy blend. Uh, bergamot, yangling, lemon, and geranium. Can't hurt. I'm gonna pull it on my wrist. That's very perky, and yeah, I mean, that's, uh, I mean, I'll put that in my purse and, you know, maybe like if I'm driving along and, and I got to pull up my butt like I do sometimes, this will make me a little less crabby. And I just poked myself in the eye. Okay, that is a $30 value. Uh, the ugly earrings that I could have got would have been a $40 value. So, yay, I didn't get that. Or there was a day cream, which I, I, I have so many creams. Um, I'm glad I didn't get that. I think I think I did good. I, I think um, I got all the, all the good scents. I did get a really excellent box. I'm quite happy. Like I said, it, it, it definitely puts me in a better mood considering um, the amount of time that I waited for the box. But, yay! <laughs> I was like, good things come to those who wait. Um, but, yeah, I, 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 I'm going to... You hear Alex in the background. Alex actually wants me to play some uh, Mario and um, that will make my my son happy and um yeah the poor kid is bored and uh yeah uh but yeah that was a good box I definitely I, I definitely got my money's worth and uh, thank you guys thank you if you watch this I like I said like I said you've probably seen the box open by now but that was a good one thank you bye bye guys